Guess how much I spent for those? Well, on Facebook or Marketplace. Good day, everyone. Uh, let's talk shoes for a bit because while I've been talking mainly uh, about bicycle tech on this channel, like bicycle components, bicycles in general, and mechanical tech really, but not really um, apparel tech or just um, cycling uh, wear in, in general. So let's talk shoes and how much they are worth, their value, etc. etc. Because lately I have been purchasing some shoes, um, well, used shoes. You can tell that um, some top end, uh, high quality, uh, high performance, full carbon fiber shoes are quite expensive. You can uh, spend up to six seven hundred bucks no problem there because they are marketed at such a high value especially because of the branding of course um, let's take for instance this uh, shoe here from specialized this is um, actually a mountain bike shoe it is an s work shoe it has a um, uh, carbon fiber sole however not fully carbon it's a, a really cool shoe with this boa system that is really easy and really really nice like really comfortable to uh, to tighten and then you just feel the pressure come on the foot evenly and those I don't know how much they retail for but as work shoes in general like three to four hundred bucks easily easily and those guess what guess how much I spent for those well 40 bucks on Facebook or marketplace used shoes but they are a really mint condition of course you have the heels that are a bit used but you see up top of here no scratches at all the previous user has has not been uh, there hasn't been any um, scratching on the cranks or something like that he even left the cleats on you can get yourself some pretty nice deals on on online platforms like facebook marketplace and then just get some shoes that somebody um, bought really really expensive at uh, well at the at the normal uh, retail price new shoes new new condition shoes and then you can get them really really cheaply because they they yeah like try them on once and then they uh, and then you recognize oh they actually don't fit they're not nice not my color not my style they just they ache they have like a little mm, my, my foot is a bit uh, weird in them this is another pair i got this those are um bond shoes mainly uh, famous because Bradley Wiggins used them uh, winning his 2012 Tour de France uh, back in 2012 and also I heard that they are quite um, popular to use on the track actually in the indoor track for like uh, pursuit uh, etc I think it's uh, due to the fact that they are enormously they are ridiculously lightweight and stiff I mean, look uh, where the carbon sole, where the carbon uh, goes up, it goes up half the shoe, also here, and then really throughout, this is only, this is just carbon, and they are, I never felt such a stiff shoe, they are extremely stiff and lightweight. Those are uh, road models, I use them for my road bike, and they are just amazing, because also you see the shape, they have a pretty large shape, uh, really in the shape of the of the human foot, which is really nice because the toes can spread evenly. They almost uh, resemble really the running shoes that I use, the ultras. They have a really an, uh, they have a really natural shape, and that's why you can that's why you feel so free in them. You feel really comfortable. They are uh, of course they have a bit uh, of a style of their own because they are so large and uh, they're a special shape. But they are pretty pretty amazing. Also here you can tighten them with this uh, plastic zip and it's almost like a zip tie action that, is, that it does here and then you have this large piece here that also tightens to the foot pretty pretty evenly so you have a nice feeling as well amazing shoe uh, retail price for this one about four five hundred bucks easily uh, I got them for 80 bucks um, the previous owner had just put them on once in his lifetime just to try them out and he thought like well they don't fit me so I put them on out for sale and you can't it is it is uh, so not probable that you will um, resell them for the same price there's a massive value drop in shoes like in TVs the value drop the minute you purchase the TV the price just drops I don't know 50% nobody wants to to buy a uh, a used TV for the same price. Uh, the same goes with shoes. Nobody's gonna pay 300 bucks for those shoes anymore. And let's go back to my uh, really 
sturdy evergreens my mountain bike shoes that I purchased uh, quite some time ago I also use them on my road bike yes I put some mountain bike uh, pedals on my road bike and I've used them really for a long time uh, the CD they are the dragon carbons 250 to 300 bucks for them also a carbon fiber sole they're quite heavy CD shoes are in general quite heavy but they have uh, they are packed with features they are some amongst the most durable shoes that you can get they are really famous for because you can exchange every single piece of the sole here not just the cleat but also the like the the rubber here uh, on the on the bottom i've used them for uh, about almost four years now and you see the rubber is still in great condition a lot of material still on and i i walk around with them quite often also you can uh, even adjust the heel in, in the back here you have a little uh, like a flat screwdriver you can put them in and you can adjust it how it tightens your heel um, well your Achilles you have those two they are like boa system but they are not really boa they are CD's own system of, of uh, CD's own tightening system really great that it works really great really sturdy no problems at all I have never had anything uh, come out or just break but there but there you see again the shape is uh, the toes are a bit tight in there so for really really long distance stuff those are still great but you you still you you feel it that they are not like the bonds you know, that uh, the shape is just not really really natural I got those um, I purchased them uh, new so I pull, paid the full price for it but you see with platforms like Facebook marketplace you just can get some uh, really amazing quality shoes for really a uh, ridiculously low price shop away on Facebook marketplace and and be a bit of a conscious consumer of course uh, conscious consumer I own like four pairs of cycling shoes but I commute every day to work I cycle about 10,000 kilometers per year or more and um, so if one shoe gets wet and it doesn't dry dry out during the night I can use my other pair and also just to have a backup pair is always nice uh, otherwise you would have to wait like a, a week for the other to arrive or you have to go out and buy a new pair so I like to have a backup pair or just a second pair also for the foot to uh, have a changing environment if you get shoes like this it's a win-win situation one can sell their old shoes that they don't use anymore and you get a really a cheap pair of great shoes plus it just goes against this consumer cycle that uh, everyone has to buy everything new again every year and so you reduce also a, a great amount of uh, waste you can reuse the stuff recycle 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 and give the, those things a second life really and you will surely have a great time because you've, uh, you can find yourself some really nice deals mm -hmm.